What's up, Hoboken? I'm Jen Sturger, your newest resident and Jets game day host. Thanks for letting me stick around. I've been living here, you know, since the beginning of August, and I'm absolutely loving it. Uh, where have you been out in town so far? Oh, you know, the usual places, like 340 Girl, just perused Washington Street. The whole, uh, Black Bear is like my absolute favorite place to go and just sit and watch sports all day long. I'm obsessed. Now you have a great tan. Where are you from? <laughs> Florida, definitely. Actually, there's people around here that are so much darker than me, and I'm like, wow, I really got to get home more often. <laughs> 1,500 red-blooded Americans just decided to apply to Florida State. And a breather. Yeah, indeed, uh, Jack. Uh, Florida State will take this, uh, Gary, and uh, looking down the road. I How did the job with the Jets come about? I was working for Sports Illustrated, and, you know, they had me come out for a couple of celeb appearances, and they liked me, the fans liked me, so it just seemed like a natural fit. They, they decided they wanted to, you know, brighten their game day experience and they wanted to do all, start start doing all this video board stuff and they decided they wanted to face for it all and I guess they picked me and it was it was just an honor really. Now do you work just Sunday or what do you do during the week for the Jets? Uh, I'm just working Sundays for right now only home games. Um, I do college sports on Saturdays so it's it's a busy schedule and a tight one but I'm finding a way to make it all work. You said that you're a big Florida State fan. Have you found a place in town to watch the games yet? No, I'm, I'm still looking for a good place. So if anyone out there knows one, I definitely would like to find some fellow uh, Seminoles up here. So what specifically will you be doing for the Jets on game day? Well, it's my job as game day host to make sure that everyone in the stadium is having a great time. And it's more so to create that home field advantage, get the crowd into it, uh, introduce the flight crew, stuff like that, introduce celebrity guests. And... Um, Hopefully, just I can represent the Jets well. Were you hired before Brett Favre was signed? I was signed well before Brett Favre. How definitely, did you? I think I'm definitely a better acquisition than he was. <laughs> How did you feel when they got him? Oh, it was awesome. I was actually out in Hofstra the day it happened, and everyone was just real hush hush. And then as the deal went on overnight, I was like, why didn't anybody tell me? I was like the last person to find out. I'm like, I had to find out through ESPN. I was like, How's the transition to Hoboken been in the metropolitan area? Oh, I absolutely love it. It's a little different than Lutz, Florida. It's a lot uh, bigger, but I, I wouldn't have it any other way. I mean, I'm just, Manhattan's nice, but it's nice over there. Uh, I like being here. I like, you know, being able to go to Malibu in my pajamas on a Sunday morning. I mean, you just can't beat it. <laughs> 